Hello everybody, we're doing something new today. Oh, it's been a while since we played a demo. This was just announced last night for me. I watched the Gamescom. Oh! <gasps> Hello. Thank you. I like that. Light is pretty. Thank you. Um, this was just announced at Gamescom last night. And this is like immediately, immediately I was like, need it. But it's described as like a farming sim horror allegory was the specific word but like farming sim horror game what i am so excited this can be very very cool um i'm a big fan of the cozy farming games i have put many hour into stardew valley i loved ooblets i'm playing moonstone island right now like you know there's so many but like we love them but i also love horror games and i also love indie games and this apparently is made by a single developer um actually why don't we oh uh, not controller support. Oh, got to got to reset. Hold on. A note from the developer. Dear player, thank you for giving my small, unusual game a chance. Like a lot of developers, I work obsessively on the computer all day, hoping that my creations will find an audience. But mostly, I daydream about never looking at a computer screen again and running away to a distant farm so I could plant and gather things in the middle of nowhere. There actually was someone who left the world behind and vowed never to take to talk to another person again. In 1986, Christopher Knight drove his car into the wilderness until it ran out of gas, abandoned it, and walked into the woods where he would stay for the next 27 years. He never talked to himself, and he literally spoke one word the entire time he accidentally ran some hikers in the 1990s and muttered the word, hi. I read the book about Christopher during a dark time in my life. I kind of envied him in some ways, until I read about the cold Maine winters he had to endure. The only way to survive the nights would be to wake himself up every few hours to walk around and warm up. Sometimes on the brink of death, he would see a cloaked figure in black standing off to the side of his campsite, staring at him with a menacing smile and asking him to come closer. He later said that sometimes when the cold was too bitter, he would consider approaching the cloaked figure, but he chose to ignore him and kept warning, warming himself up. Even though there wasn't any people around, Christopher wasn't as alone as he thought. Maybe one day I'll explain more about how I've actually been doing the past few years and how... And, and how it resulted in this game. It was born of pure self-hatred and desperation, which makes it my most personal work yet. I'm kind of embarrassed by the things I've felt and gone through, but it felt good to put those feelings into this story. I hope you enjoy the demo, and I wish you luck as you face the inevitable main winters in your own life, even if the cloaked figure waits for you outside your tent. Sincerely, David. Oh, what a lovely message. Oh, oh I'm excited about the game, but also this is... That he created this game to deal with his his mental health and oh, oh we love that healing through art and we're gonna get an opportunity to play something cool today so that is what we're doing let me just rearrange myself here i'm not a big keyboard gamer but let's let's give it a shot those eyes that demonic face in the rearview mirror that's when it all started Oh. my mom's old truck to drive back to New York like I always do. Okay. But something happened that I can't explain. I saw my exit, turned on the blinker, and drove right past it. Goodbye. Goodbye, old life. crazy, but I physically could not turn the wheel. So I drove for four hours straight. Oh. I was in a rush to nowhere. So I drove... Oh, it's kind of pretty. It. it felt like the only right thing to happen to me in years. All I wanted was to walk down that path, lock the gate, and leave everyone behind. Farmstead short short it sale. Would cost me everything I had, but I needed solitude. Okay. So I bought the farm. time that I laughed. Hmm. I couldn't believe I was actually doing it. I was finally ready to forget it all and be forgotten. Oh, We harvest shadows. What a hard-hitting intro. I guess it wants me to throw the key though, right? Are we ready? You made me promise, Garrett. Huh. Keep that promise, Mom. 
went ham on the private property sign. Oh, you know what I just remembered? In game, after games come. Oh my gosh, I hope my audio is working. Af Ooh, oh, it's getting dark. Oh no. Oh no. Day one. The Unseen Wanderer. Oh no. All right, Garrett. Today's the day. You're gonna leave the house. Hold your applause, everyone. But where did it's I put so that to-do list? If I can find in all this garbage. Dude. Things to remember. Check my... Oh, jeez. All the sounds. Check my to-do list every day. Don't forget to use tools. There should be some laying around the house. And I can buy more in the mail order catalog. Get to bed on time. These woods give me the creeps. Drop things in the trailer to sell them. Tree logs are worth a few cents, but tomatoes and chicken eggs are much more valuable. My ultimate goal should be buying the rifle, but I'll work on my to-do list first for, for a few days and save up some cash. This is the rest of my life now, forever alone in the best way possible. However, I did send one letter after buying this place. He's the only one who has my address. I wonder when he'll get here. Okay, uh, Q to close, F for flashlight. Okay, ooh, it's so dark and spooky. Oh, meh. Okay. Um. Oh, you know what? It's here, jeez. Um, okay, calm down. There, there's my to-do list. In the Gamescom reveal, there was a little mini interview after, and the developer was saying that there's a bunch of Easter eggs in, um, in the trailer where basically, like, our character thinks he's alone and wants to be alone, but he's actually being watched at all times. So there's like faces and stuff you can find. And now I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna feel like I see it everywhere, but okay. Uh, to-do list, my notepad, oh, oh. To-do list, your to-do list is essential. Press tab to view your tasks. Tasks marked with an asterisk are required to progress the story. Completing any optional or required task usually earns you money as well. You can view your money and important items at the bottom of the notepad. And close. Okay. So tab it in. Oh, jeez. I'm the greatest dopamine release possible. <sighs> Cleaning your room and scratching it off your to-do list. Okay. Did it just get... Oh, the sun's rising. It's getting brighter. Okay. Man, everything is scaring me. Okay. Pick up trash in bedroom and throw it in the trailer. Buy a watering can. Water six tomato plants. Okay. So, um, oh, let's close the door. Carry. Ooh, carry. Oh. Oh, it's kind of satisfying how, like, it, it pops up in the box. Do, 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 do. So we just bought this house in this state. Like this is day one. We're making it our own. I'm now realizing that I've signed on to do like, oh, that reticle is really. Oh, this is heavier than it looks. It's fine. It's fine. The trailer and catalog shop are near the side of the house. Oh, there's. Oh. What's that? Inspect an eerie painting of an oh, endless hallway. I don't remember this being here. Oh. The painting. Oh my gosh. Keep an eye on the mysterious painting of the hallway. It will change in subtle and sometimes not so subtle ways to signify your mental state and alert you to danger. The more horrifying the painting, the more danger you are in. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. I'm so afraid. Okay. Side of the house. Trailer. Uh, door. Oh. Okay. It's daytime. It's fine. Do we have a dog? <gasps> no. We have a four-wheeler. Is this where I'm going? Man, it's pretty here. Not a soul for miles. I should have done this years ago. There we go. I can run. Trailer. Oh. I mean, I think we've all been tempted at one point in our life to be like, let's just sell it all and avoid... Wasn't okay. Bad. Maybe I can get Twenty these tomatoes cents. watered, and then I'll be done. Ooh, pick up the now, this axe. Come in handy. Okay, tap Q to holster. Hold it to select a tool. So put it away. Hold it. Select a tool. Got it. Okay. Is this the catalog? I need a watering can. Browse the catalog. I need a dollar. Okay. I don't. Oh, I do have a dollar. Level one. 
Oh, okay. But if I look at the catalog, yeah, I have level one already. Grass hook, rake, farming meds. Oh my gosh, house. Ooh, fun, fun, fun. Okay. So hold Q for a tool. Water my tomatoes. Uh, I think I missed. Did I do it? Oh, you can go to bed early if you complete your to-do list. So tab for the to-do list. Lot, but it was something. But it was something, and then I holster that. Bed. Um, well, we should explore it a little bit. Eternity to go. He sounds so happy now, like just blissful. But. This is gonna. This is so strange. Like taking the cozy farming sim, and adding indie horror flavor. Like, ugh. all right, let's take a further look around the house. The picture on the billboard that said like homestead was way did not imply that this was like a gross and abandoned house. Bathroom, nice clawfoot tub. Maybe a good cleaning. Excuse you. What the fuck is that sound? Oh, what's in there? What's on the floor? Okay, a note? A map of the area. Looks like it's missing some pages. Yeah, a little bit. Map and compass. Access your map by holding Q, but you'll first need to visit Lookout Towers before it's useful. If you have found all items in, the, in a certain location, a check mark will be added to the icon. There are no in-game waypoint markers, so be sure to slow down, study your map, and plan your next move with resolve. <laughs> with resolve. Okay, put that away. I'm definitely... Is this a basement? It's rusted shut. Oh, no it ain't, no it ain't, no it ain't, no it ain't. It's a door that should never be opened. I'm good food-wise for a long time. Cans okay. of beans as far as the eye can see. As far as the eye can see. Um, I'm too afraid to put my other freaking headphone in. Why do I do this? Why do I play these games? I'm home alone. Okay, it is daytime though, and it is a lovely sunny day. And I, maybe I'll just make a rule that I won't play this game when it's not lovely and sunny, but I'm afraid. Okay, sleep. Oh, why do I do this? Why are you waking up so early? Wake up with the sun. <gasps> There's someone in the yard petting my, my horse. Okay, collect tomatoes. Buy the build book. Build a chicken coop. I need two dollars. Or is that how much I have? Two dollars. Um. Okay. There's someone in my yard. Oh! I do not want to look at the painting. What is that? Claire? Whoa! Huh? Goodbye! You remind me of someone, girl. Oh, 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 oh. He said that everybody was gone at the beginning. Oh, I'm looking around. <gasps> I'm sorry, oh, I just hi. can't get over this view. I can't believe you yeah. didn't cross the bridge before. Yeah, but why leave downtown anyway? To come see me, obviously. Of course. Hi. Good point. You're cute. Point. Oh, there's Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> Is that a deer? How did she even get here? Hold on, give us some space. Oh, I thought I was gonna get hit by that car. Oh my gosh. I've seen that too many times in my real life. Oh! It's okay. It's okay. Let's get you home. Claire, please Claire, don't leave me. Do you ever think about me? Like I think about you? Do you ever wonder where I am? Oh, jeez. Okay, collect tomatoes. Get back to work, Garrett. That's all you're good for. No, Claire's out there somewhere. I hope. Um, collect. 
Oh, and oh, you can see the tomatoes go in the basket too. And the music. This is such a strange dichotomy of like peaceful and beautiful, but I'm there's the spooky and the like daytime is going to be so lovely, but nighttime is going to be that much scarier, I guess. Um, can we go a little faster here? No? Oh, is that my stamina? Can I drop? Okay, five dollars. Okay, what do I need to buy? Buy the build book and a chicken coop. Okay, it's just a little too loud. Okay, I need to... Buy... Tomato, buy the build book. Okay, unlocks the ability to build structures near your house. Okay. Okay. You and got then this. just follow the instructions, bro. B to open build book. Do I want another tool? Should I just buy the rake? Oh. Ha! A weapon now. Okay. And we hold Q for tools. Okay, so we're gonna put that away and hit B for the build book. Standing torch, fencing, wooden fence. I see structures. Standing uh, homemade torch for some extra light. Oh, okay. Um, exit. What did it say? Build a chicken coop. So, oh, chicken kit. Unlocks chicken items in the build book. Okay. Oh, I bought a rake when I should have bought this. So I need to get more money, which means I have to go through another day. Uh, what's this? Available in the full game version. Okay, right. I gotta remember this is just a demo. Okay, so we're gonna be so brave and walk around with our axe out. Oh, what's this? Oh, rocks. Um, can I sell rocks? Ah, okay, well let's, can I chop down a tree? Oh, you can actually see the mark. Okay. Oh! Oh, come back. Oh, I am a strong, strong, oh, but I walk very slowly. Okay, that should be just enough. It'd be cool if I could, like, increase the size of the reticle, because you see it there just a little bit, but it's... And I'd like to change the color, but okay. So we need to go... Oh, build book is what I can build. So we need to go over to the catalog. Oh, ignite. Yes, okay. I'm gonna put torches everywhere. Chicken kit. Buy now. Perfect. And then we exit. And we go build book. Livestock. Oh, no. Chicken coop. Comes with six nests and open roof. So I need $10. So I need ten dollars and I have ten cents. Okay, so those tomatoes are good. Okay, let's do a quick wait, uh, very important. This is working out good. It it also feels good, like it runs good. Um we're gonna have some visual glitches as always. Can I hot damn, this doesn't even look that old. I could totally fix this up with the right parts. Oh, I just assumed... I guess it is pretty busted up. I just assumed that that, that was yours and new. It's kind of beautiful, though, here, eh? What's that? What's that? Oh, it's a crow. It's on my house. Hi! Painting? No. But the door is opening. Oh no. I don't think I closed this door behind me. Okay. I hate this. It's amazing. Oh, oh, it's dark and weird. Go to bed. Go to bed. Can I have the covers? Your to-do list isn't complete yet. What? I can't go to bed if the to-do list isn't complete? I don't have enough money to build a chicken coop. I have to stay awake all night? I don't like this. Uh, I have to go out. It's gonna make me go out at night. 
Oh, I'm gonna scream. Guys. Okay. Run. Run to my torch. Okay, we're lit here. Things fine. I literally have to cut down trees and sell stuff. It was only like 50 cents a log. Oh! I made a poor choice. Oh, not what I meant to do. Um, pull this out. I shouldn't have bought the rake. I can't go to bed. It won't let me. Oh my god. It, is this the way it's supposed to be? Is it supposed to... Like, was I, was there never any hope of me making enough money? Like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Go to my torch. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. That could have been worse though. That could have been worse. Nothing to say? I don't even have my hands on my controller right now. I'm just like, or the, the keyboard, I'm just. Hello? I'm so tense. Build a chicken coop. I was trying, Claire. Yeah, but we're gonna wait till the sun comes up a little bit. I need those tomatoes to grow so I can sell them. Big sounds, big sounds, big wind. I literally am like waiting until the sun comes up. <sighs> Ah, that's better. Any visitors? Okay. The door's open. Oh, because I passed it outside. Oh. Door's closed. Oh, but the whatever was in the there is gone. Oh, I don't want to stand close to that painting all of a sudden. All of a sudden... Hello. Okay. Tomatoes. Yes. Okay. Please make me money. Oh, 540. Okay. That's not enough. Close though. Okay. Close. Let's grab a log. These are what? 50 cents each. So I just need to put four logs in and we're good. Okay. We're going to get a chicken coop today, guys. Nobody panic. Okay. After this, I presume we're going to get to do some exploring. Maybe go fill in our map a little bit. I wonder how many days I get for the demo. Okay, build a chicken coop. So I should go build book chicken coop. Ooh, okay. Where should I put my chicken coop? Uh, right here. Exit. There. I have a chicken coop, but I don't have chickens. So livestock was a whole other thing. I need $5 per chicken. So we're gonna buy some chickens next, I guess. Um, but the day is young. Should we explore a little bit? Our to-do list is done, so we just need to make it uh, to bed on time. No concept of what time it is. Oh, I just realized I could jump. Ugh. Good night. Oh, maybe I can't explore. Maybe the demo says no exploring. Hmm. Hello? Wow, this looks like pure zinc. I read that an old factory is nearby. What do I do with it? Do I just sell it? Ooh, ooh, maybe it's maybe because it's metal it's worth more, and I can sell it and buy a chicken. And then I can have eggs tomorrow. Gosh, the flip-flopping in my mood and in everything. This is crazy. As soon as the sun goes down, I just get squirrely. <laughs> I would say that. This game is doing exactly what it intended to do. <laughs> so good job. I think the developer's name is David. Good job, David. Ooh, but you know what that means? When we get really scared and we want to curse someone out, we can be like, God, fucking damn it, Dave. <laughs> okay, so should we sell it just to see? Ooh, $30. Oh, let's buy some chickens. But let's not buy too many chickens, because if I have a to-do list, it says buy a chicken. Chicken. Book. And here's your friend. Chicken. Let's buy three. 
Let's buy three chickens. <gasps> Friends! I went once one time, played a D&D &D campaign. Oh, this chicken. Oh, there we go. And there were three kobolds, and they were Flint, Glint, and Tint. So, Flint, Glint, and Tint, welcome to the horror zone. Okay. It's, it's too dark now, so we're going to go inside. Don't look at the sounds. <gasps> I'm in danger. I'm in danger. I'm in danger. Go to bed. Oh my god. I'm sitting like so far away from my screen. <laughs> I'll take a quick look outside. It is nighttime. What's that sound? It's still day three. I am like leaning as far away as I can. Okay, we're just gonna. Oh. Oh my god. I'm just looking down. Is it the deer? Chickens, are you okay? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, is it you? Goodbye. Nope, the fucking tree scared me. Go back to bed. Go back to bed. Go back to bed. Come on, Garrett. Holy warning, the lonely nights can destroy you. Nighttime in the forest can be especially dangerous. You can avoid the night by finishing your to-do list and going to bed early. You can also clean your home and regrow your farm. The greater your farm site grows, the more productive you'll be. Okay. You're a grown-ass adult, Garrett. There's no one out here. Where am I? Go and look around if you're so scared, you baby. Too scared to sleep right now. TV? Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I, I can't. This is too scary. What? Should I just watch? Oh. Go to bed, go to bed, go to bed. So tense. I used to. Wish that wasn't the case. Okay, the music's nice. Now that was horrifying. Turn off TV. Okay. Okay. Wait for the sun to come up. Do I have a to-do list? Buy a better axe. Explore the inside of the barn. Oh goodness gracious. I'm stressed. I am very stressed. But the sun is coming up, so this is fine. This music is comforting. It's like, why were you so scared? It's fine. Chickens, try to feed you. How do I? Ooh, <gasps> eggs. Hi. Some on the other side too. <gasps> Good chickens. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's a cat. Hi. Pet. I think I have a food bowl on the porch for you. Kitty visitor. Oh, yes, come here. We thought we had a fill. Come. You coming? You coming for your food? Oh, we get a cat. Oh, we got chickens. We're gonna like that. Always like that. Okay. And then we're happy music again. Buy a better axe and explore the barn. Okay, axe level two. I got the money for that. Okay, well, let's get our to-do list stuff. This is what we've learned. Out and be on the fence now. Let's see what's out there. This barn? You can break wooden fences with your new axe. Oh. Okay, that seems like a waste, but 
<gasps> There's someone in the freaking barn. Claire? I must be seeing things. Hi. Please don't jump. Please don't jump. New location discovered. Hello? Wow, this is incredible. This will be perfect for cattle. Is it bedtime? Plus ten dollars? What does that symbol in the corner mean? Does that mean bedtime? I just I just got here. Or does it mean I need to rest? Are you still up there, Miss Pam? No? How do I get up there? Ooh, a ladder. I feel like it's gonna be weird. We can, like, see things. See our own house. See things happening to it. are not only used to buy the best items in the catalog shop, they also require to complete the game. Keep an eye out for them as you explore. Okay. Ooh. Oh, <gasps> a dog. Shit. Where? Or is it a wolf? Where? I wanted this piece of metal. Hi. Do I have to defend myself? you. Hey. I don't want... You don't look enough like a wolf. You look like a dog. You don't... Where's the other one? What a waste. Where's my medal? Where's my medal? Run. Oh. Another piece of metal. Okay. Can I carry multiple? Run, 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 I don't like this. This doesn't look enough like a wolf. It just seems like a dog. We good? Oh, okay. No, oh, I keep... Stop doing that. Where did my metal go? Okay. Okie dokie. Chickens? Because now that the... No, oh, I gotta close the chicken thingies or the eggs will get got. Nice. Okay. Okay. Uh, to-do list. We're good. 94! Okay, and I have an oil can now. Uh, I wish I could tell what time it is. Can I do that? Can I just go to bed? The sun's going down. Can I just go to bed? Chapter complete. New shop items unlocked. Okay. Okay. What the hell do I do now? It does not seem like morning. Oh, chapters. To progress the story, go to the shop and buy an item marked with an asterisk. It will start a sequence of important events and tasks which will lead to revelations about Garrett's past and future. Completing chapters will also unlock new items in the shop. Okay, so I need to go buy a certain item. I wonder if I can buy that rifle yet. I really want to go outside at night, but... Uh, can't be found in optional tasks in your to-do list. Break up three tree stumps, sell 12 logs, pick up and sell all the trash in the downstairs. What? This wasn't here before. I have a feeling we're, like, losing time and, like, we think we've only been here for five days, but, oh, jeez. 
my box full? It is. Um, kitty! Hi! Can I pet you when I have garbage in my hand? Pet. Hi! I guess I should fill your, your bowl. Okay. Um, buy a rifle. And that will start a series of events? 30 cents. All that trash. Okay, so book. New items have been unlocked. Tools. Rifle. Oh, I don't have quite enough money. Close to it, though. Okay. Yeah, this is like leaves and stuff. Like, I forgot to close the door one night. Many nights. Okay. Ten pieces of trash later. We're cleaning. We're doing this stuff. It's kind of satisfying. Kitty! Oh, I need to go fill your bowl. Right. Right, 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 right. Okay, this might be the last of the trash. Now you're gonna give me a little, little money boost. Nice. There, I have enough money. Okay, let's let's see what happens when we buy the rifle. Bye now. Purchasing this item will start a sequence of events that culminate in the ending of the demo. Are you sure? Yeah. Finally, some good news. Shoot five cans off the log pile east of the house. Log pile. Okay, it's getting dark. Bad things are gonna happen. Bad things sound like they are happening. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this. Dark and spooky. Dark and spooky. Oh, my to-do list. Fuck. Well, where's the freaking log pile? <laughs> Yeah, I know it's bedtime, but it won't let me go to bed. I know. I'm gonna pass out. I know. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I hate this. Minus one dollar. Remember to get to bed on time to avoid losing money. Chapter two. The diseased couple? Shoot five cans on the log pile east of the house. I just can't find that. Okay, okay. Getting brave. We have a gun now. We're getting brave. Well, the cat's bowl. <clears throat> Sun rises in the east. Oh, I have a cut in my hand. I just noticed. So I feel like... If this is going to be like mental health related and we have that painting, then the to-do lists, ooh, log file, finally. Gosh, I just had no bearing of where it was going. <laughs> um, so even if we do those optional tasks, aim, nice. Okay, sell 12 blocks. So now that we've been playing for a little bit, I think something I'm not loving is that I can't end my day by choice. Like, if I don't have my to-do list done, it just says you can't go to sleep. And I understand that there's a penalty, like there's already like a money penalty if you don't get your to-do list done, you pass out. But I just, I feel like I should be able to be like, yeah, go to bed and then take a, like, it should just be like, are you sure? Because you're going to get this penalty if you go to bed early. Like, I do think I'd like that. But I maybe it'll balance itself out a little better going forward. But there's just been a couple times now where I'm like, I want to just go to bed. And I know it's because I'm scared. But nothing happens at night other than, like, so far nothing has been happening at those nights that I, ha that I have to stay out, right? Although it's just forcing me into the scary zone, which I guess is part of the point, but... I think a little bit of this is weird because my brain is like, it's flip-flopping so much between horror game and cozy game. It's a very strange experience. It's so well done and it's achieving what it wants. But so far I think it's the only thing I'm not a big fan of. If there is, maybe I'm just missing it. If there is some sort of like background effect that staying out late has, then it makes sense. But right now it just seems like I just stay out late, my to-do list isn't done, and I just pass out. Oh, did I not fill that today? Keep it filled at all times. 
close the door. Spooky man's gone. But I guess doing tasks will keep my mental health good. Oh, that was weird. Okay, let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. the witness, right? Yeah, they said it's not ideal, but we need to grab someone from the tax office. Okay, oh. great. Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. Get well, married? I think he's waking up. <gasps> Baby it's me. Okay, Garrett. You keep resting, sweetie. We got a ways to go. Okay, we're here. Can you scoop him up? He'll wake up on the way. Okay, I got you, bud. I got you. It's okay. Oh, this is so sweet. I'm sorry, I was but gone for it's so not going to stay this way. I won't leave you again. Okay. He sent the letter to his dad. I'm just so tired. I have so many years left. What am I gonna do? Maybe coming out here wasn't a good idea after all. But I can't go back. I'd rather die than go back. Oh, honey. This is so sad. Let's just go look at our chickens. people out there. There's people. I'm surrounded. Oh, is it Claire? Oh, and she walks away and disappears before I can get to her. This music. Just get to the end of the day. Let's collect our eggs and pet our cat. Small things in life, okay? It was raining, so I should get tomatoes. I think this game is gonna do a really good job of telling this story. I'm like sad, but a part of me is also like really appreciating already like the the vocabulary and and just how it's presenting this idea. Obviously, this character is suffering with like loss and grief and and depression and just everything, right? And this is just his way of dealing with it. Yeah with horror but just like in the note that the creator left for us right that that this is just how he got his feelings out light the torch okay our chickens oh can we pet the chickens where are you guys no kitty it's raining he's probably not around we should name the cat Okay. Taking care of the creatures. The house is clean. Can I just go to bed? Your to-do list isn't complete. Just get to the end of the day. I guess I have to just wait out the time. Okay, there's some logs we can move. Just keep yourself busy. That's the key, I think. Keep yourself moving and going and doing. And every day it gets a little bit easier, I think, is the is the point. The day's got to be over. I guess I don't get a concept of time, eh? Ah, I can go to bed now. I don't feel good. The, 
the bed's gone. What the frick? Something wants me to follow it to the shed northeast of the house. What do you want with me? Can't I just live here in peace? Is that too much to ask? That way. Was that a little boy's voice that was like, follow me, come with me, something like that? The shed, I went in the shed already. That's where I found that first piece of metal, right? The shed? Am I in the right direction? Yeah. It's all in your head, Gary. Stop being such a little bitch, you lunatic. Anything else? Just whatever this is? Read a strange note. Oh, geez. Look. Back away, but don't look too long. I need to get back inside. Oh no. <gasps> Uh, back to the house. Back to the house. Back away? What? What is it? Don't look too long. Oh my gosh. 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 No! Get away! Get away! Wherever you are! Jeez! Okay, the diseased couple are hurting me as I back away but don't look too long and run. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No, no. This is terrifying. Oh my gosh. But don't look too long. Oh, I almost missed the house. Hi. Jesus. Go to bed, go to bed, go to bed, go to bed, go to bed. <gasps> Claire? Claire? Talk? I'm so sorry. Holy fork. <gasps> Holy fuck. Thank you for playing. I have already wishlisted this. That was intense. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Holy fork. Look at this. And the art's beautiful. And the lamb. Full game includes new tools, one square map of land to explore, crafted with love, an emotional four plus hour story with an unforgettable ending, bonuses like endless mode, dev commentary, and more. Wow. This is a piece of art, I think. This is not just a game. This is when people take the medium of, of, of making a video game and, 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 and make it art. And this will be one of those games that I feel like you show to people who don't think video games are an art form to prove to them that video games are an art form. Oh my goodness. But that was terrifying. And I think it achieved exactly what it wanted. The weird dichot dichotomy and like flipping of my brain from happy cozy get to this to-do list done to like oh my gosh I'm traumatized wow wow I didn't know I needed this in my life but that was awesome wow go wishlist this guys I'll link it in the description thank you very much for watching I'm gonna go for a walk in the sunshine now but oh, that was good so good David is it David good job David well done